questions. I really don't know what I'm going to say to you. <laughs> you know, I had been studying physics and I knew something about that technology, but Kabbalah as a science was something that never would have even dawned on me. I don't care what you're doing. There is something about this field of way of thinking, of seeing, which can improve anything. And I don't care if you're a Jew, a Muslim, Gentile, Arab, I don't care what you are. I don't care what nationality, I don't care what religion you belong to. There's something in this that will, I think, awaken something in you. It tells us how we can change the entire world through inner transformation, because each person has a small world within him. There are these three-dimensional pictures like wallpapers. If you look at them and you defocus your eye, then you go into the picture and you find a three-dimensional picture. When you look at it at the beginning, it looks like just a jagged random pattern. Yes. Mm -hmm. And then after a while, you see a a kind of flat 3D image. Emerge. So these things. <laughs> so what the wisdom of Kabbalah actually does is it helps you get that picture. It doesn't do anything new actually. It just focuses and aims your attributes and everything in you in such a way that you begin to see into matter. Thank mm -hmm. you.